Well, it's been a little bit of time, but back down here where the uh, excavators are in the dump truck. This afternoon, got them power trench put in, or the power wire put in, trench back filled. Uh, like I mentioned before, there's a lot of rain coming from that hurricane. Obviously, it's uh, not a good time to start on the pond, but it looks like this has dried out possibly enough to haul brush. So I got that little secondary streak. I'm going to uh, 350 still sitting down there. I'm going to try to load Barney and haul some brush over there to the burn pile. And just try to get it all up here where if it gets too wet to work anywhere else, I can burn that. But uh, yeah, it went from extremely dry to excessively wet now. As we've had 12, 13 inches of rain in the past uh, three weeks. And they're calling for another five to eight inches of rain out of that storm. So yeah, we're definitely getting caught up on our rain here. Well, let's go down here and see uh, what the burn pile looks like. Haven't been here in about almost two weeks. Well, it doesn't look like the pile burnt down that good. But it definitely dried out some. To find a spot where I can turn around, probably just back in here and dump it in there as tight as I can. Because I remember I was almost getting stuck out here before all that rain, so... Well, I mean, there's a pretty good spot burn out there. That's the way the fires do. They just burn a giant spot out. Everybody's like, just need to leave it alone. Let it burn. Well, if you don't keep adding to it, that's exactly what it does. The fire will not spread through green stuff like that. Which, it's dried out a lot now. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to burn... It's a touch, it ain't really dry, but I'm just gonna worry on getting some brush hauled up here for today. Go ahead and drive the dump truck down there. It's gonna take a little while for the air to build up on it. Here we go. Let that air condition cool off for a little bit while the air builds up. Well, the 350 still sitting here nice and patiently, waiting to go to work. I'm gonna grab this little bit of stuff and start uh, scooping all these piles up that I cleared. Looks like they have dried out some, so that's a plus. See how much of this brush I can get hauled this afternoon up there to the burn pile. brush here. Already hauled one load. The truck did get stuck, so that's a good thing. Definitely need to try to put as much as I can on each truck load. I don't have a whole lot of spot and room to dump up there. Not really a lot of spots that are dry enough to hold the truck up. So I'm having to kind of like back behind the pile. I can really only run about one row of brush out. So I'm gonna have to make each load count. So we'll just pack it in there like that. And I should be able to put a lot more in there. hauled up there today. I don't think it'll be a problem. Get about two of these piles per truck load. My only problem is this machine's not as delicate separating the piles. So if I have you know a bunch of sticks hanging out one side it's hard to get them broke up that it'll fit in the truck.
By golly, you can get a scoop of brush though. truckloads of brush so I'll pack them in there at least I think that'll I can get a pretty good fire going with that it looks like that's dried out decent I don't know how much of a path I'm gonna have left after 10 more trips though tear the ground up you drive these trucks over some wet ground and it will rut it all up but there's really no other way of getting the brush over here efficiently
big pile of brush. Let's go do it again. tell these logs ain't gonna stay up there. I'm gonna use my better judgment to not put them on there. That way I'm not playing pickup sticks down the path. But the brush will stay up there. in the rainforest now it just rains every day now well the good thing is I got uh, all but like two loads of brush out and the machine's still running in there so I'm gonna go back and load up one more and drive out with it but uh, yeah at least uh, I did have enough time to get majority of the brush up here so I don't know which way the winds blowing heck I'm almost tempted to go down there and get the 220 and uh, see if I can't stack that up and get that burning it's definitely not going to spread into the woods now decisions decisions <laughs> 